So today I basically had no clue what to do for this video so I'm doing a my everyday every day my everyday makeup even though I don't wear makeup every day I don't wear it on the weekends because skin's gotta rest anyway so this is just my video first I have to put my hair up I'm going to use a toner on my face and the toner I like to use is the Clinique clarifying lotion in the combination oily one. I took a shower this morning but my face is dirty. I'm going to use some lip balm on my lips because they are chapped and I'm using the raw chai spice lip balm. And next, for my lotion, I'm using the Crabtree and Evelyn Rose Water. I should not use, be using body lotion on my face, but I don't care. I just use it anyway. Because I'm so clean, I'm taking a hand sanitizer, and I'm using that. I should have done this before I touched my face, but, you know, priorities. Well, that's on now. First, I will start with an eye primer because today I'm just going to... I don't wear eyeshadow all the time because I'm lazy and I like my sleep. But today, just for the sake of having something in this video, I'm wearing eyeshadow. And since I have an oily face, and oily eyelids, and oily everything, I'm using an eye primer. Usually I would use the Urban Decay D-Slick in a tube mattifying gel under my foundation and my T-zone because that place is an oily mess. But today, since I'm not keeping my foundation on very long, because it's like 3 p.m. and I just decided to film now. Since I'm not keeping it on very long, I am not going to use that. And the foundation I'm going to use is this new one I got yesterday, and it's the L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Makeup in C6 Soft Sable. And whoop, I need a mirror. First time using it, using it, and I got it dirty all over the bottle. Then I take this brush, which is very dirty right now, but I will wash it soon. Probably not, but whatever. And this is from Crown Brush, and I got it off Hot Look, so you can get it there when Crown Brush is on there again. I'm just getting my mirror, so I can see. This foundation is very nice by the way and if you haven't tried it you should try it from what I can tell because my skin looks really nice like really nice kind of looks natural too make sure to blend it now on the neck so you don't look like that chick who has her makeup stopping right here and next I'm going to go in with my concealer and I use the Maybelline, the Maybelline one, you know this one, everyone knows this one. So, and I'm in the color 30 Cafe. Which is just literally those spots. Next, I'm using my Rimmel Stay Matte, and I'm in the color 001 Transparent, and I'm just using a Real Techniques. 
powder brush if you were wanting to know. And I just literally press it on my nose. And then I go in wherever else I need powder, which is my whole face. Next, I'm going to bronze my face with the MAC blush in the color Blonde. I just use this brush, which is also by Crown Brushes, I believe. But then, it's a powder blush, brush, and it just broke off, so I just kept this part. So. so I just take that on there and tap off the excess because it's super pigmented. And I just go for it. So I just bronze my cheeks first. And I go into the sides of my head. I'm trying to make myself look slimmer than I actually am. Like I have some kind of healthy glow going on. <sighs> Usually I would stop it stop stop. I would stop a bronzer. But sometimes I like to use a blush. And so the blush I normally use is Golden Copper by Mary Kay in the Mineral Cheek Color. And I just use it on a dual fiber blush, br whatever, it's a brush. So I just poke it in there because it's just a tiny square and tap off the excess. Ooh. And then because I'm paranoid about having unblended things, I just take my powder brush and I just blend everything. I go over everything, literally my entire face. Oh my god! I almost forgot to set under my eyes, which I do all the time, literally. I forget all the time that I'm on the bus to school and I'm like... <gasps> Anyway, I just use this brush in the same normal stay mat, and I just press it in. First things first, I'm a realist. No, actually, I'm just going to be using this Benefit Cream Eyeshadow in the color My Two Cents. And this is what it looks like, and I'm just using this as a base to start off. Usually I would just stop here, put on mascara and my eyebrows, and go about my daily business, but you know. I'm trying to look like I know what I'm doing, so. For my eyeshadow, I'm using this duo that my mom got me for my birthday. It's the NARS Is Old, I Sold, Is Hold duo, and. This is what it looks like. I'm not such a big fan on this because I don't like light eyeshadows on my eyeballs. So I'm just going to go in with this one all over my eyelids. By the way, this thing is wickedly pigmented. I'm just going to keep going in and building up the color because I'm about that. This eye. So pretty, it's like an orange bronze. And I'm just going to take it under my eye sockets so I can look like I'm grungy. Whoops, you can't see there. So that's it with basically. The eyeshadow. I'm using my Rimmel Scandalized Waterproof Coal Liner in brown. And it's brown again and it's just a little stub so I hope I don't stab myself in the eye. I did. Anyway, so I'm doing my brows now and I'm using just a brow spoolie from Elf. I'm going in with my tried and true one and only love which is the 
NYX Automatic Brow Pencil in the color, I don't know, dark brown. Doing brows is really boring because you can't really talk about what you're doing like, oh, I'm drawing hairs in. Like, no poo poo. I go in with my Benefit Guinea brow and and next we're going to the interesting part which is my mascara and I have three different mascaras that I use and I pretty much like all of them except maybe this one the covergirl lash blast volume because it doesn't give me va va voom lashes which i like so i usually mix it with something else like this one so and this one i just like using on its own by itself and this is the jordana best lash extreme volumizing mascara and that is what i shall use today trusty mirror in check I hope you can hear me because I'm just talking. Last but not least, my lips. Anyway, usually I use a Revlon lip butter in raspberry, no, no, berry smoothie. I use berry smoothie, but then I can't find that right now. So I'm going to use a completely different look that kind of re recreates, recreates what I usually go for. So I'm just going to use a lipstick and a lip gloss. And the lipstick I'm using is MAC Taupe. And that's just taupe right now. And then I'm going to use the NYX Mega Shine Lip Gloss. And, I'm, and I use the color tea rose and this is what it looks like and I just put that on top anyway I think this is pretty so yeah and this is what my makeup would look like if I woke up at like 5 a.m. every morning for school so this is my makeup if you like this give it a thumbs up if you did not like this, give it a thumbs up and then leave a comment on what else you would like to see. I don't know. And yeah, subscribe to my channel and it's very hot so I put my hair down for a while. So, bye!